420. How can consumers best help with leading the industry more towards sustainability? Start asking the people who are selling you products at the at the retail level, what's the profile? You know, what you know is what's the what's the greenhouse overhead? What do you know about this product? Start asking instead of asking how much THC is in it. <laughs> or you can you can still ask that, but ask the next sure. question. Ask the next question. You know, how is it grown? Or what was you know what was what was if it's a pro if it's another product like gummy, say what's in it. You know, how is it made? Um, you know, and uh, to, to to tell you the truth, the if if you look at the market research, you'll see that a lot of the decisions in the industry are driven by blood tenders. Okay. Um, but that's that's but blood tenders tend to be the you know long experienced sort of heavy user, um. not to a bad point, but but. So they drive the, the the uninitiated, the the curious consumer, towards things that they think are important. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, and you know, until until the consumers start asking the bud tender, who really does have a lot of influence in the industry, uh, you know, what is the background of this product? You know, how was it grown? Um, you know, what is the greenhouse gas overhead? How much energy? You know, whatever they want to ask them. But until those questions start start trickling into the bud tender's ears, um, my feeling is it's not going to get to the folks who make the product decisions. You know, we're starting to see that. I know one company, one one large MSO, who has actually noticed that that some consumers are starting to ask the you know the the same the, the folks who are asking about their lettuce are starting to ask about their cannabis. But it's just starting, and they haven't really done anything about it yet. But they're mm -hmm. hearing it. Uh, then that's what you can do and ask, you know, ask how, ask, you know, if this is going to be the right experience for me and tell me about how, how it was grown or made. Wonderful. And Perfect. I'm sure no one's going <laughs> right. to know. Right. Right. Especially at the uh, retailer level, they're like, um, they're not going to have any yeah. idea. <laughs> but ask the right. question, that's, vote with your dollar. But then they'll ask, you know, the next person. Yeah. So. Right. right. You know, and then it might get on the website and then it will get into the training for the bud tenders, you know, and um you know and you know or you know when you if you i mean like right now if you look at a, most vendors websites basically it's a retail store with no information about the product <laughs> uh, it's it's do I, you know, there are it, it's it's very even the amazon website for buying something on amazon has more information about a product mm -hmm. that you're buying than the cannabis websites actually have yeah, that is wow. hilarious. It makes yeah, sense. gotta ask the question. Yeah, start ask, start asking the question, and it will drive the industry. Forward.